Uh, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Speaker, for giving me this opportunity. And I would want to stand here foremost very proud of my fellow scholars who are right on track in the world of academia, where Honorable Dr. Joy Satino Sogo is found as an academia. Number two, Mr. Speaker, I rise to support Beatrice and Dr. Oduol for having achieved in academic standards. And that was evidence on how they presented their cases, on their publication, and thorough mastery of content on what they're going to represent the Kenyans. Mr. Speaker, I rise to support the two ladies, and I wanted to go on record that I salute, it must be on record, His Excellency Baba Raila Molodinga for the support of the gender, female gender, for the nominee that was exhibited, that gender rule on female is quite fundamental in this country by the president, Dr. Samuel William Ruto. I want also to say that for the peace which was supposed to be maintained, even it was exhibited yesterday when Baba was in a function that President the late Uhuru also informed that stability was important. Electing and appointing the women creates stability in this country. Order Ben Suda. Uhuru Kenyatta is a retired president, is not a president elect. Not elect. I'm saying Uhuru is retired. I'm talking on stability. Get the concept of what I'm heading to. I'm talking about stability of this nation. And so I want to say, Mr. Speaker, when this nation has started recognizing the competency of women, women of substance, women who are academicians, women who are effective, gone are the days, Mr. Speaker, where women thought that their bottom powers can make them rise to power. And we are saying that we are not on occasions where women thought that either through sex they can rise to power. Time up. Dorothy, Dorothy Chiara.